Have you ever been with a group of people and someone mentions that one of their chakras is blocked, which sparks a whole conversation on divine energy, spirituality and the body? And you're sitting there like, what the f*** are these people talking about? That used to be me, and if that's you, or you just want to learn more about them, here it is. Understanding chakras is not only for spiritual folk, but even for people who are just trying to heal or feel connected to themselves. The chakra system originated from India, written in the oldest Hindu scriptures on earth, the Vedas, between the years 1500 and 500 BC. It is important to understand that there are many chakra systems for many different purposes. But most likely, if you have heard someone speaking about the chakras, they are referring to the seven chakras that connect your physical, mental and spiritual body. Globally, this has become one of the most well-known systems. Before even speaking about chakras, we need to dive into its essence. Energy. Everything that exists in this world is made up of energy and is constantly moving, vibrating, all at different frequencies. Your eyes may not be able to see everything moving because of how fast it is moving, but nothing is ever still. Everything is made up of energy. You and I are energy. The device you're watching this off of is made of energy. The water you just drank, the mountains, your thoughts, the last thing you touched, all pure energy. And our bodies and our chakras are 100% energy too. Chakras are main energy centers of the body and run from the base of the spine to the top of the head. Chi is our life force. Chi is the energy current that runs through our bodies, providing us with circulation, nutrients, and minerals that we need to be whole. It's our job to keep our chakras open and flowing between one another. Often this is not an easy task, especially through hard times. When there is an imbalance or blockage of chakras, this can lead to physical, mental, or emotional pain or disorders. Each one possesses its own color and vibrational frequency. These wheels are the catalysts of consciousness and human function. Your first chakra is your root. The root chakra represents survival consciousness. It is red, which symbolizes safety, survival, grounding, and nourishment from the earth's energy. A healthy root leads to a logical mind, physical strength, and orderliness. Its position is at the base of our spine and is considered the human's relation to the earth. Rooted to the natural world, it's our stability. This chakra color represents instinctual fight or flight response and is centered around feeling safe, comfortable, and confident. Exercise, sunlight, proper nutritious food, and a good night's sleep are very important for keeping this root chakra healthy and balanced. When you feel stressed, afraid, or worried, your root chakra can be blocked. When you're feeling strong, healthy, loved, and happy, your root chakra is open to you. The second chakra is the sacral chakra. The sacral chakra can be found below the belly button and the orange chakra color is associated with emotions, creativity, and sexuality. A connection with other humans through sex, fertility, and reproduction. Desires and feelings of intimacy come with the sacral chakra. And when we are lacking the ability to connect intimately with ourselves and others in a healthy way, an imbalance or block is created. When your sacral chakra is blocked, you may feel it is difficult to be emotionally or sexually open and are involved in unhealthy toxic relationships. You may also have trouble viewing the relationship with yourself and body image as negative. When you are aligned with your sacral chakra, you will experience self-love, healthy sexual experiences and other pleasures in life. The practice of tantric yoga is known to help align this chakra color.